All right, check this out, guys. So when I was approached with this project, I wasn't really sure how everything would pan out. And so Casey Calden and the Calden family asked me if I would help build a project truck for them. And so um, this was something that we kind of used as a template. And we weren't sure how it was going to come out. but So I ended up, uh, we reached out to Barnett Farm Toys, and they built this truck here. And we decided that we would go ahead and mirror this truck in real life. So I just thought you'd want to check it out and see how it turned out. Take a look at the cues, the fenders, even the drop panels. You can see some of the things that we did. We made some changes. So I'll put a link. I put part one video up here before we started this. But how cool is that? Whenever people tell me or ask what I do for a living, I tell them I build life-size Tonka toys. Well, this one is absolutely true. Um, but I actually built a Barnett farm toy. So you want to see some cool rigs, go to the Barnett website and check them out and everything. So I actually got another project or two that are coming up with some more toy trucks that we are building into real life trucks and so I think this thing just turned out phenomenal so wanted to throw a quick shout out to my guys over in my body shop score you did a great job on this one brother I appreciate you really good job show you some of the things that score did so on the top we did the smoke top lights Painted visor. I can't tell you how difficult it is to uh, match a farm toy. So on this one here, the visor is actually chrome. And we did not do the horns on the top. And you can see the decals we did down the hood. Good job, Matthew, with ProGraphics here in Denver, Colorado. Check out his website. I'll put a link to it down below. One of my favorite things, I like old school stack guards. Classic stacks. I think they look just absolutely super cool on this truck. Then what we also did, we chopped the air cleaners down. That was a score project. Then we did the um, Phoenix. We call them the shine back lights. And then we have the shine down lights here where you got your light panels that go down just like on the toy. Now on the toy, the tank straps were painted, but on this one we went ahead and painted the tanks to match. So again, I did a split tank on this one. He's going to be running a live bottom system. And I want to show you real quick underneath how clean Imco did the install on this thing. It's pretty sweet. Super clean routing job. Great job, Randy, you and your team over there at IMCO here in Denver, Colorado. Got your PTO kit on there. Then I had another body tech. Uh, score put the first section of merit deck plating on this one here. And uh, he actually carried it on through all the way to the back. So that uh, modular deck plating from Merit is pretty sweet. And then they carried all the decals and everything back around the back side of the truck. And then these are paintable minimizer fenders. So we added a little bit of extra touches on this to bring in the, the pinstriping from the side of the truck. I think it turned out phenomenal. 
Mike, my painter out in my body shop, he's the one who matched all this stuff up. Tim Potter, credit to you on a color. I'll put a link. This one's a 565, 280 wheelbase. Peterbilt oval rims, Michelin tires, full lockers. And then we also painted the def tank. We did twin 150 setup, which is, seems to be becoming more and more popular, especially with the def tank filler cap being up a little bit higher. But we painted the sides green so that when you're back away from the truck, it just looks like another tank strap around there. This one is an automated 18. Just an absolutely gorgeous truck. So I'll put a link to the rest of the build so that you can see what the before looks like. Super proud of this one, guys. I mean, I think our body shop just did a bang up job on this thing. If you guys like these videos, click on the button in the bottom right hand corner and subscribe. Love to have you join. Got more stuff coming along. Hope you enjoy these videos. This one I've been so excited about. Thank you, Casey, to you and your family. Tom Sr., Kip, Miles, Tommy, all you guys are awesome to work with. Really, really appreciate you guys. And as always, like I say, I hope this truck is a huge blessing to you, your family, and your business. And we'll talk soon. Stay safe, everybody.